Hello ladies and gentlemen, my name is Sam Spielberg and thank you guys for tuning in to this very quick Source Filmmaker tip tutorial thing. So I have right here a quick little action shot that I'm working on. I gave the camera some uh, some, some nice jitter, it's in slow-mo, we got some explosions going off, people getting shot down, good stuff, good stuff. With the heavy in the background being the uh, central focus. So we have this, uh, we're focusing more on the camera here for now. The camera is pretty nice where it's at, it's got some nice camera jitter, but I think I'm gonna add something else to it. I think what, I'm, I think what we're gonna do is we're gonna have the camera rotate around, uh, around heavy right here. Um, so I'm gonna go ahead and show you guys how I would go about doing that. So first what I'm going to do is I'm going to look in the uh, model viewer for a small model for this tutorial tip, whatever, I'm going to be using uh, this little helper thing, which I was discouraged to discover does not come stock with Source Filmmaker, but if you have the Left 4 Dead 2 assets loaded in Source Filmmaker, uh, you should be able to find this, but really, any small object um, will work for this thing, so I'm just going to use this helper because it's just what I use, so uh, it will spawn where your camera is, and what I'm going to do is I'm going to drag it, and uh, another tip, in order to get a model to run along the surface of the world, if you hold down shift while you move your mouse, uh, the model will move along the surface um, of the world. I don't know if you can see that very well. Um, but yeah, so I'm going to put it right at the bottom. I'm going to put it right where Heavy's Root Transform should be. Um, and I'm going to place it there. And now I am going to uh, find the uh, camera. Where's the camera? Camera, camera 4, we're using camera 4, and I'm going to take either the, I'm going to take the poly surface here, you can take the root transform too if you want, uh, but I take any other additional bone, I'm going to attach it to the transform of the camera, and uh, now if we take the poly surface, we take this bone here and we rotate it, you'll see that the camera moves along with it. So now all we have to do, so now really all we have to do here is just uh, animate the poly surface bone here, which we'll do in a second, and the camera should follow it. So yeah, uh, now all we have to do is animate the uh, animate the helper, which we can do by putting it, because I want the rotation to last throughout the shot, so we'll start at the beginning of the shot, and I can even go into the camera and look at where we are. So that's, so that's a good start, and then for a good end, we want it probably... Right about there is good. Not too much of a rotation. And there we go. We have a little bit of a rotation. It's not terribly noticeable, so I think we're going to make it a little bit more noticeable. So for the start, we're going to move it back just a little bit. There we go, because I still do want the heavy to kind of be obscured. That's even a little bit more extreme. That's a little too extreme. Because I still want the heavy to be kind of obscured, because we're kind of searching for him throughout this intense battle and stuff like that. So, yeah, right there's good, and we'll, we'll play it out, let's see what we get. There we go, the rotation is a little more pronounced, now that we, now that we have that going. And that's a pretty nice effect. Now, of course, we can still see the, uh, if we look hard enough for it, we can still see the, uh, boop, uh, let's see, yeah, right there, we can still see the helper right there, so, and that's a quick fix. Just turn it off, and we have a rotating camera. So, that's pretty much it, guys. That was a quick little tip that I wanted to share with you guys. If you guys have any questions about uh, this tip, or if you guys have any questions about Source Filmmaker, or really anything in general, please feel free to ask. I'll do my best to get to it, and who knows if it's, uh, if it's uh, intense or good enough, or whatever kind of question, maybe we'll uh, discuss it in a video or something. But uh, I'm going to wrap it up, guys. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I will see you guys when I see you guys. Take care.